Hey y'all, this is Amanda with Tap Mom and the Big Brigade. Welcome back to Mornings with Jesus, our daily devotional. And uh, today is Monday, Janu um, February 6th. Sorry, I'm <laughs> mixing up months here, okay? And as, as of course, every other Monday, I try to read our prayer request a list. And um, it's gained some names this week. It's getting kind of long, but I'll just read through it uh, real quick. Uh, it goes uh, Jody Fink, Krista Searles. Annie Knight, Amy Smith, Karen Dodge, Kelly Manier, Cindy and Robert with Pups and Crochet, Linda Coulter and family, um, Marsha Norton and family, Lisa the Grammy, uh, Scattered, uh, see, Atlanta Hawkins, Sonia West, Deborah Hypes, and Marina Gilbert, Cherise Crochets, uh, Camper 14, also known as Tina, uh, Nova with Nova Gnome Creations, Tracy with Crochet Rocks, Lisa with Lady Bird Loves, uh, Kaylina, Patricia with Yarny Cat Crochet, Llama Mama Kayla, we all know who that is, Sheena and Destiny Sorrels. So if y'all would remember them when y'all pray, I'd greatly appreciate it. And today is Monday, February 6th. And as usual, our devotional start with a Bible verse and then an inspirational story. So here we go with our Bible verse. And he said, Truly I tell you, unless you change and become like little children, you will never enter the kingdom of heaven. Matthew 18, 3. Now our inspirational story. This morning I caught a snowflake on my tongue. My husband and I walked around the block, savoring the fluffy snowfall. Sounds became muted. Grubby streets shimmered with a coating of brightness. It stirred memories of being a child and walking up the day, waking up the day of a blizzard, a snow day. School is, was closed. Instead of the expected routine, we had a surprising day of freedom and fun. Snow angels, sledding, and cocoa. When I when I ponder what Jesus means in his call to become like a child that sense of excitement and joy becomes com, excitement and joy comes to mind children have the capacity to embrace a gift and revel in it jesus offers a surprise far more exhilarating than a snow day instead of trudging along trying to draw close to god by my own efforts jesus steps in to whisper the work is done. You're free. John 19.30 Strange as it seems, that's not always easy for me to embrace. I often slip into striving for God's approval when Jesus reassures that his love is already unconditional. I feel a need to remind everyone of the rules. Instead of celebrating undeserved grace, I worry about temporary, temporary problems on every side, even though Jesus has said he has gone ahead to prepare a place for me, John 14, 3, and that eternity will be free of pain and tears, Revelation 21, 4. So today I'll respond like a little child to a blessed snow day, Sharon Hennig. Faith Step, what brought you delight as a child? Enjoy an activity that reminds you how to have childlike faith and exuberance for all Jesus has done. Yep. Sometimes you just gotta act like a child sometimes and remember what it's like to not have a care in the world and place all your burdens there at Jesus's feet because that's who can handle it better than we can. Anyway, I love y'all and so does Jesus and I will see y'all on the next one. Bye now.